Stephen Buck. Thank you, Mr Speaker. Could we have a debate on opening up network rail to full scrutiny by the National Audit Office? Because due to the bizarre legal entity set up by the last Prime Minister, it stands to have brought to a small number of members, including train companies, and answers neither directly to Parliament nor to company shareholders. Well, the, the, the governance of network rail is an extraordinary uh, constitution. And, of course, it is right that it should be uh, exposed to full, um, full audit. I will raise with my right honourable friend, the Secretary of State for Transport, firstly, whether we have any proposals to change the governance of network rail, which may solve the problem, or if we haven't, whether we have any other proposals to make sure their accounts are properly looked at.